Hi, my name's Sophie. Um, I'm studying architecture, so I'm going into my fourth year this year, which is the beginning of the Masters of Architecture. Throughout my last three years of architecture school, I found a real keen interest in housing and in community and in sustainability. I found out about the summer scholarships through the university, so I sought a supervisor who also had an interest in it and had the connections and the knowledge, which was Bill Mackay, and he was really helpful this summer at giving me some guidance. Sophie's really interested me because it's so current to Auckland at the moment. Um, as most people know, the proposed unitary plan is really going to intensify the number of apartment buildings in the city. Uh, so looking at how they're done well is really crucial to what we do. I just propose the idea of having a look at what's actually working in terms of um, New Zealand dense environment um, and dense housing instead of what public sometimes perceive as like, scary apartments that are going up and are going to ruin the city and all the views and be unlivable and monotonous. I was sure that there were some good things that were going on out there. so. Yeah, that's what I was um, keen on looking at, more of the positive approach to it. Uh, yeah, this place just, it's not really the most visually appealing. Refuse collection is very prominent in the public access way, which is probably not the best design. If you live in that block, you have a space where you can bump into your neighbours, as opposed to just an entire space down in the ground floor. Uh, personally for me, it's a really great base for me to then enter my postgraduate studies in. This summer has given me the time to get a lot of deep research into that, not just the um, surface level um, research, but really being given the time and the opportunity to look into what is actually going on and what Auckland's proposed um, outcomes are for this. And yeah, starting to become a part of that is really exciting.